Hey there guys, welcome back. Deatrice here, ready for another let's play? Hopefully you are, because what better time to go exploring than uh than than now. So uh to begin our journey today, I'm gonna go ahead and go over to our uh, little catacombs entrance here, just outside of the, the graveyard. And we're just gonna start, you know, going to town. We're just gonna start making this thing. You know, I'm going into this challenge with a bit of a uh, problem. I only have a wooden pickaxe, but I have nine iron with me. So I'm going to conveniently place a crafting bench right here. And go ahead and make a uh, an iron, a good old little iron pickaxe. There you go. Right off the bat, we're just going to go down. I want this to enter into a staircase to a bigger room, a couple levels lower. Yeah, so we're just we're just going to go ahead and just bring this down just like so. Make sure you got your your torches handy, guys, cuz it's going to get dark. Wow, okay, so we're only a couple blocks down, and we've got an opening here. We're gonna have to investigate this. Get wrecked, please walk into this. Wow, what an idiot. I don't need to use my sword. Alright, so now that we've defeated the en Okay, they just keep coming. Oh, come on, what am I dealing with right now? There's like a thousand zombies. Something tells me uh, there's a zombie spawner somewhere nearby. Because these guys just don't stop coming. Let's go ahead and open that up. That might have been a mistake. You just gotta be tactical. If there is a spawner, we gotta find it quick. I'm taking fire. I gotta eat something. I need to heal up before I go in here. I'm kinda mad. Alright, let's go ahead and get our torches ready because we need to find that spawner. Oh, there's a skeleton. Oh my god. Alrighty guys, there are quite a bit of tangos down in the catacombs. Uh, we're gonna have to take them out from a distance now. We gotta go ahead and get our bows ready. Let's just creep on in here. I got an enderman like right in front of me, so I can't look up. This is a sight to be seen, guys. There are zombies pouring out of the catacombs. This is terrifying. Oh, this is ridiculous. I just gotta try to get my stuff real quick. Oh, they're at the doorway. I'm screwed. This episode is turning out to be much harder than I was expecting. I just gotta strategy my way through this one. I mean, they're just mobs, right? Oh boy. Let me just get my stuff. All I want is my stuff, guys. I'm just knocking them dead. This guy's proven to be difficult because he's got a bunch of armor on. Yeah, I'm just retreating over to my bed now. You guys know how it is. You gotta just, you just gotta lay down and wait till morning sometimes. We've all been there. Happens to me maybe a little bit too much. That's quite alright. I don't judge myself. Wow. I just outmaneuvered you so hard, dude. You just got so outmaneuvered, man. I think there's still some of my stuff sitting down in the catacombs. So, uh, I'm gonna try to just dart in there real quick. Shouldn't be a problem. Oh, we found it. Oh! Ooh! Got a saddle and way too much gunpowder than I'm uh, supposed to have. <clears throat> what is this a little bit? What is this? Why was that glowing? This is pretty exciting. We just found a zombie spawner right next to our base. Wow. Maybe the catacombs is going to have a pretty cool purpose. The catacombs is going to be home to our new and improved zombie spawner. Let's go make it. Well, I got to, you know, get some resources and stuff, you know. You know how it is. You can't just go down into the caves and stuff without being ready for it. How did I not catch that the bridge wasn't even nearly finished? There we go. That's good enough. You can't see that, right? That's how you save your bricks. Speaking of bricks, let's go check on these eggs. 
Oh, two stacks and uh, then four, which is cuatro in uh, Espanol. Oh, look at all of them. Keep on, young chickens. Lead a healthy chicken life. Drop those eggs. Drop those eggs for me. Keep dropping those eggs. Eggs. All right, we're just going to leave them be and let them go ahead and do their thing. Drop their youngins down into my crate. Let's go ahead and grab some stuff for this uh, this little build here. I don't know why I grabbed some gravel. Maybe uh, maybe we can just add that in somehow. We're definitely going to need a bucket, so we need a place to put this lava. Yeah, let's just leave that there because I need this bucket. I don't even care how close I get, man. Oh, 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 I like it. Um, oh, oh, okay. Oh, man. What did we lose? That was literally the last time I was going to do it, too. Uh, tell me I, we lost the saddle. Okay, it's right here. Oh, man. We still have the diamond shovel. The Minecraft gods are on our side. Ah, oh, my torches. Ah, where... The case of the missing torch. Come on. It is not important. It's not that important. Now that I think of it. I even found an extra one. We're good. We are fine. Yeah, you know, let's just go for it. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna jump right into it. Me and my uh, my wooden pickaxe. I'll be the only one here that has to struggle through the uh, the mining process right now. Who am I kidding? You know I'm gonna build an iron pickaxe again because I'm very wasteful. But uh, bing, iron pick. Right, we gotta remember that we came in through up here. If you notice me going the wrong way, just comment down below. Uh, it, I know it doesn't make sense, but just just go ahead and do it. I need the comments. Wow, this iron has already paid for itself uh, three times over. Math. Who knew this episode was going to get so wild and freaky so quickly? Wow, you know how much torches I can make with this, guys? Look at that coal, boy. We do not need to worry about burning logs anymore. I found the mother of all veins of coal, and I just found some more. Aw oh, man, but now we got water against us. Let me show you guys a little uh, a little old school trick. But a bing is gone. Having a zombie spawner this close to home, I can deal with that for sure. Hey man. Oh boy. You know, just when you're talking about how happy you are in life, just when you think you finally made it, a zombie just pops up. Come on man, go ahead, figure it out. Figure out how to get to me. Do it. Figure it out, man. Idiot. Walk away. Pussy. Pussy bitch. Aw oh, man. I wasn't talking about you, man. I was talking about the other guy. <laughs> What's the matter? Can't fight the stream? Yeah, well, neither can I, man. I'm just gonna... Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Guys, you really don't need to attack anybody in this game. You just need to out-strategize. It was getting pretty wild down there, so uh, let me go take a quick nap. Oh, no, no. Okay. I probably shouldn't carry around a, a bucket of water in my hand. I've gotten way used to jumping out of that bed from all the, uh, the deaths I've had. That's the stuff that uh that gets to me. That's the stuff that I think about when I can't sleep. Ah, oh, man, come, leave me alone. I'm, oh, you having trouble uh, hurting me, bud? Okay, yeah, you're not having trouble at all. Where's my bread? I don't have any bread, man. What does hunger mean? Oh, why did I stay still? That was ridiculously bad. Ah, oh, now he's just guarding my stuff. Come on, man. Come on. All right, yeah. So back to uh messing around down here. Oh yeah, we don't need this. I'm kind of bummed out it's only a zombie spawner since we already had one built. At least this one's closer to the house. One thing to uh, remember when you're working on a zombie uh, spawner is to keep extra torches around because uh, you could turn around and there'd be one spawned right across the room. Yeah, it's pretty dangerous so I always keep some extra torches. Keep a torch in your pocket. Keep a torch in your backpack. You can even keep a torch in your wallet if you play your cards right. She's a going. She's got some momentum here. Hey, what's the matter? What's wrong, bud? Get nice up and close, right here. Like I said, guys, just outsmart your prey. No need for uh, swords or anything like that. See, we don't even gotta go. We don't even gotta leave. We still got some health left. I, I can't believe that worked, actually. If there was ever gonna be a moment that I realized I wasn't recording, it would be this one. Just because of how ridiculous that was. I think I figured out why I brought all this useless gravel. Fill all these nasty little holes in. Ah, oh, man. I was wondering how... <laughs> Are you kidding me, man? I'm sitting here wasting my life dropping endless amounts of gravel into a torch. Uh, I thought there was just a really far down hole right there. I wonder how many crafting benches I've made so far. I make way too many of these things. I'm a working man. I'm realizing that everyone here 
that subscribed has already seen me make one of these in like episode two or three or four. So I'm just gonna skip to the end of this thing being made. If you want to see one being made, go check out my uh, my other episode in the Let's Play. You know, self promotion. Go, go check it out, man. Go ahead. I think we're gonna make this one way cooler than the one before. For this spawner, it's gonna be a little bit more high tech. For this one, they're gonna drop the 22 blocks and then be uh, lifted back up to where I am. And hopefully, if I play my cards right, we're gonna be able to have a uh, area where we can watch it all happen. I think that'll be pretty cool. I'm I'm pretty excited for it. Oh uh, yeah, see what I was saying about the torches? Always have some with you. Can you leave me alone, man? Like you're not even supposed to be alive right now. You hacked your way into this zombie spawner that's not even done yet, man. Come on, dude. I'm eating your friends. Watch me eat your friends, dude. Come on. I was gonna make another crafting bench, but I remembered I had one like right here. <laughs> it's it's just floating there. How? How did how did I just lose my water? I just lost my water out of nowhere. Alrighty guys, this seems like a great place to end it. Uh, next episode we're definitely going to get this finished. So uh, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, be sure to, be sure to uh, go ahead and comment and uh, go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead, just do it. Trust me. <laughs>